On today's episode of Casey and Grumpy Do Things, we are looking for a delivery van that slid off the road and into someone's fence. But we don't quite know 100% where it is. We just know it's on one of these roads out here, so we're driving around until we find it. And we're running out of fuel. Oh, I didn't check the fuel. We got a gas can, though. Oh, okay. We're good. And a battery charger, so we're good all the way. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so I left my house today, and we were cruising down the road, we heard a big thump. Like, what was that? Oh, I never unhooked the battery charger from the truck before I left, so... It probably still works. I'm sure. Nice view from up here, though. Oh, yeah. Man, that is really when, nice. When the wind blows. Oh, yep. my oh, there's our van. Okay, let's oh, go see what we got. Slide off. Oh, he went backwards through the fence. Yeah. I get it. Okay, let's go check it out. Got it. We need to throw the tops over our socks. Done. Now I'll put it in four wheel drive and go up the hill. Okay, we made it no problem. No, I'm gonna use the chocks. I don't wanna put the spade down on the driveway. Those would be better. I'll get it. Maybe. Yeah, it is. Let me free spool the other one. There it is. Just had to break it free. Get this right here. Huh? That doesn't have any hooks on the front. No, I'm gonna have to go with the control arm. Okay. It's 150 feet on each one. My big truck's got 200 on each one. Okay. That's when I was in when they called and I'm like, what kind of situation is he in? Cause I'm in a really big truck. Uh, so if I can reach it from the road, fine. If I have to go into a driveway, uh, probably not a great idea. Yeah. So I stopped and switched trucks on the way. It's been a very busy last couple days. Oh yeah? Oh, yeah. uh, I've been all the way between here and Chamalt today. Oh, yeah, in the big one, not this one. You want to do the pulling, Grumpy? You want to pull him out? I'll go down there and watch that he goes around. Yeah. This one right here says driver. I'll give you hand signals. In, out, stop. Okay, you want to hop in? You must get some amazing sunsets up here. It is amazing, yeah, for sure. 
perfect. Go ahead and fire it up. Parking brake off. Put it in neutral and hold your foot on the brake. And turn your wheel to the driver's side just a little bit. Passenger a little. Passenger. Right there. Okay, foot. Okay, foot off the brake. You can put it in drive if that makes it mad. Okay. Hold your steering wheel right there. Hopefully we'll go right around this post. Okay, turn passenger side just a little right there. We're gonna try to go center right over that same bush and hope it's still standing after. It held up once. Hey, 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 the tree did too. <laughs> yeah, the tree popped right back up. Okay, straighten up a little. Right there. Hold it right there. Okay, now go passenger. Right where you're at. Okay, more passenger, perfect. Perfect. Okay, straighten up. Straighten a little more. Right there. Make sure it's not gonna pull you over into the tree which it's not. Perfect, right where you're at. Okay, now turn back to your driver's side. Hold it right there. Okay, more driver. All right, straighten up. Okay, put it in reverse. Okay, let him out. Turn to the driver's, pass yeah, passenger, sorry, my bad, my bad. You're right there, yeah. Go ahead and go out. No, 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 just winch him out. Now just winch him out and lower him down. Just make sure we don't run out of cable before we get to the end. Okay, straighten up. If you stay on this snow kind of on the edge, turn my way a little bit, you'll have more traction than if you get into that glary yeah. ice spot. Just stay right here on the snowy stuff and you should be pretty decent. Hopefully we got enough rope. You look good running this. Huh? You need a full-time job? Yeah. This truck fits you. My age. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I think it's the age thing. Yeah. Two grumpy old pieces of equipment out getting stuff done. <laughs> I think we'll make it.
Go drive her a little bit. Yeah. Go a little more driver. Get you back over on this snowy or powdery stuff instead of that ice. Okay, now straighten up. Man, what a view from up here. I think the fence is even okay. I mean, it's not like perfect, but it's better than it was. It's like it never happened. <laughs> yeah. Hit your brakes and see if it holds there. Perfect. Okay, let off. I just want to see if you had traction there now that you're not on the powdery stuff. I think you're good from here, so. Hold your brakes. Okay. All right, just hold it straight right where you're at and you can ease back. You're on this powder, so you should be fine. Perfect. That's what I like to see. Good. Yeah, it looks like it's snowing over there on the mountains. That's the whole Cascade Range over there. There's a... Yeah, all the way down, see the whole range. Yeah, we have some friends living in La Pine here. Yep. Thank you, sir. Hey, let's get out of here. They were asking if those snow socks were... I said, yeah. <laughs> yeah, a lot of people ask, like, well, yeah. Now, you ready to go skiing down this hill? We should have took them off first, made this adventure. Yeah. End up in the living room of that house right there. Uh -huh. And then just sat in front of the fireplace. <laughs> the fireplace on the other side of the house, see the chimney? We gotta go pretty fast to get to it. <laughs> go all the way through. Yeah. Look, I even fixed the fence. Yeah. I don't know, it didn't take a full while. No, that came out really lucky. Alright, pull the socks off and we're done. So it is as simple as you pull them up. Off the side, do that on all four, roll forward half a tire and take them off. Exactly the opposite of putting them on. On and off in like a minute. That simple. Good job, Grumpy. Yep. That was climbed, a good one. Climbed up the hill, pulled them up, dropped them off. Yep, that worked out really, really well. So now we're going to head out of here, look at this beautiful sunrise. Grumpy is just going to say something before I cut him off, so now I'll let him finish. Um, 
the UPS, uh, FedEx driver said he was going to get wheel socks for next time. <laughs> yeah, they make a big difference. Yeah, they They're do. just so easy and quick to put on. I know. It's and on that ice stuff, they make a huge difference. And they work really well. They do. Yeah, I'm not like sponsored by them or anything. Hey, hey, uh, auto sock though, if you're watching, let's do some stuff. But uh, no, I, I buy them, I use them, I like them. So yep. there we go. They are good and saved us, and we're going to head into the sunset now. What do you say we stop at the Falcon store and get an old fashioned root beer for a job well done? That wouldn't be a bad idea. We're going to go do that. You guys have a good one.